Welcome back, fuckers. All right, today we're going to run through uh, the uh, the comms, the radios that you're going to need for the A10 or that you can use for the A10 uh, and how to set them up, how to use them, and all of that good stuff. So we're going to jump on in the cockpit and quickly run through those motherfuckers right now. Here we go. Strap yourselves in. All right, so we went through in the, uh, the startup in the first uh, tutorial of the series, how to start up. We've turned on our VHF, our UHF, and our FM radios. All right, so VHF, you can change by left-clicking, right-clicking on each of these little knobs. Ow, you're making my ears bleed. I don't know what that was. You've got a couple options here. You've got preset, you've got manual, you've got AM, you've got FM, you've got transmit, and you've got direction fine. All right, and your presets are there, okay? Generally, you're not going to use that one too much. Okay, sometimes you will, but most of the time you're going to be using this bad boy here, the UHF. So this is your one that you can tune into AWACS because AWACS is normally uh, 251. Okay, the other ones don't go into the 200. So UHF is what we want. Same kind of deal here. We've got on the radio, you've got off, main, both ADF, and you've got manual and preset. So if you had preset uh, radio channels, you could go to preset and then again, cycle through your presets if you want and then this bad boy is the exact same as this one except it's in fm okay on your uh 30 so that's one that one they'd probably use for or you will use to be talking to jtax and stuff that are on the ground using 30 fm or helicopters and shit like that so that is your radios so that's all well and good but how do you use them so we're gonna quickly go f10 and we're going to Go back to Glenshick. Just gonna get the radio freaks for Glenshick. So we've got ATC here. So we've got 39.4, 255, and 126. So let's uh, bring up the old scratch pad again. We'll write all those in. Okay, 126, 39.4, and 255. All right, so let's punch all those in. So in our front one, one, two, six, we are set. Uh, three, nine, point four. And then on this one, two, five, five. All right, so this one here, the first one, if we want to call up, get rid of that. Um, call up the ATC on the VHF. All right, we want VHF AM. That is the name of this radio. So you're going to need in your controls, HOTAS mic switch forward, okay, is the default to use that front radio. Okay, HOTAS mic switch forward uses VHF AM. So I've got for my controls, uh, for ease, this is what I do. I use left control one, for the front one, left control two for the middle one, and then left control three for the aft one. Okay, so that's if I want to talk on the front one, I'm like, okay, I know that's the first one in line. It's number one, number two, number three. Makes sense for me. That's how I fucking roll. So we are going to use VHF uh, AM, which is called again, HOTAS mic switch forward. The next one for the middle is called HOTAS mic switch down. And then the third one, OTAS mic switch off. So you need to have those bound to a uh, button on your HOTAS or your keyboard or whatever you want that you use for your radios. So I normally use left control one and two for my comms menu when I fly in every aircraft. So that's just what I use, but you can have it. It is default set to your, if you've got the uh, Thrustmaster Warthog throttle, it is set to the actual mic switch. All your binds in here will be set to the actual uh, mic switch or it switches that as they reflect in the jet so it saves you a lot of uh key bind setting up there's a couple you've got to do yourself manually but most of them are uh, set up so that's the ones you want so remember first one vhf am is hotas mic switch forward vhf or uhf is a uh, hotas mic switch down and then vhf fm is mic switch aft okay so we're going to go control one vhf am Control two, CB, UHF. Control three, VHF, FM. So we're going to, uh, we'll go on the FM first. All right, so we're VHF, FM. We're gonna do ATC, Glenshik, and we're gonna do request takeoff. Kalinsk, in field. 
One, one. Request Galinsk, takeoff. have you say the name. See if he talks to us. Maybe no one's in the tower. Come on, brother. All right. Nothing heard on that one. So we're just confirming we are in manual 39.4, which is what we had. 39.4. No response. All right, so we'll try the other one. VHF AM. Just take off. Field. One, one. Request takeoff. Enfield 1-1. One, one. Galensic, you are cleared for takeoff when ready. Climb 300 at QFE 29.85. Alright, so we've gotten, gotten clearance there. Now we're just going to confirm. So that was on uh, the VHF AM, okay, which was set to 126. Now we're going to go to the CB UHF, which is now set to 255. I'm going to say abort takeoff. Galinsk, in field, 1-1. One, one. Abort takeoff. Enfield, 1-1. One, one. Taxi to parking area. There we go, and they talk to us. So, uh, at Galinsk, or however you say it, uh, FM doesn't work. They won't talk to you on FM, but they'll talk to you on UHF and on AM, VHF AM. Okay, you'll be able to talk to them. But if you've got a JTAC, generally they're going to be like 30 or a low frequency. So you set up your low frequency. UHF is above 200, if I'm not mistaken. And then your VHF is up to 215. Ah, oh, my ears, they're bleeding. Don't do that. All right, so that's how you use the radios. And just make sure you, you bind the appropriate one. So for the front one, clarifying one more time, the front Radio is called VHF AM and it is mic switch forward. The second one is called CB UHF and that one is mic switch down. And then third one is called VHF FM and that is mic switch aft. Okay, that's the ones you want to bind in there. And then that way you can contact the relevant uh, ATCs or flights, whatever you want to talk on and actually request, you know, refueling, landings, takeoffs all that stuff right oh boys hope that helped if it did make sure you uh, go ahead and hit the like button on the video helps a lot and if you haven't already hit subscribe on the youtube channel and uh thank you very much for that if you have already appreciate your support legends and lastly but not least i do stream on twitch so if you haven't come and check me out come on by and hang out i stream on monday to friday 1300 Australian Western Standard Time. Come by, say hello, ask any questions, go live on stream. And if I can't answer it, I'll tell you straight up that I don't know. And hopefully someone in chat will uh, be able to help you out. And we'll nut it out together. Righty guys, catch you on the next one, fuckers.